tell we China to build make medicines in China, Excuse not America, me. needs to go and get on the social media. As politics got you down, maybe you lost a friend or a loved one to cable news. The threat that zombie raccoons may pose to this country. Well, I got three factoids guaranteed to turn that frown upside down. Factoid number one. We finally got the bipartisan infrastructure law. I'm just a bill sitting on Capitol Hill. Not anymore, buddy. What? You got signed into law. I'm talking 1.2 trillion buckaroos to rebuild America's roads and bridges, water and energy infrastructure, and broadband access for everyone. Each pin here represents a newly funded project. But don't take it from me, just ask my guy Justin from Colorado. The bipartisan infrastructure law means that we finally got funding to fix this highway. We're gonna do it with union labor. We are talking 10 years of good paying union jobs. Oh yeah. Factoid number two. Have you heard of something called the Inflation Reduction Act? This law gives tax credits to energy companies that pay a prevailing wage and hire through a registered apprenticeship program. It includes a Make It in America provision that sweetens the deal if they use American-made equipment. Now let's check in with our guy in the field, Omar from Wisconsin. Take it away. I'm Omar Tamayo with Local 330. We're here at the Springfield Solar Project. The Inflation Reduction Act brought solar farms to this area, allowing us more construction jobs like this. We are talking good union jobs and a clean energy future. Factoid number three, a little something called the Chips and Science Act, signed by our president to incentivize microchip manufacturing. That's why we got these new factories popping up across the country. Let's check in with Brian, who's working on Intel's multi-factory mega project. Without the Chips and Science Act, we'd be shipping this stuff off to China somewhere. It's really nice to be trying to help out the state and the country. If you're building a wind farm, battery plant, chips factory, road, bridge, or other infrastructure project, one of these three historic pieces of legislation probably helped get that project off the ground. With this pro-labor White House, laborers have a seat at the table, and we've been using it to make sure that the jobs that are created a good union jobs. It's thanks to laborers like you that the clean energy companies are paying workers fair wages, manufacturing is coming back to the USA, and our infrastructure is getting repaired. And I want you to keep it up. You're doing a great job. Get involved with your local union today. <laughs>